Watch this. Ta-da! Awesome. Not too shabby, Sketch Boy. Do another trick, Alex. Please. All right. Check this out. <laughs> num bum ba, rum num a num. Sweet. Incredible. Thanks. I have a great teacher. But in this case, the student has left his teacher in the dust. Do a new one. One we haven't seen before. <laughs> All right, but this time I need help from the audience. A book, please, Zoe. A thick one. Here you go, a dictionary. This dictionary holds surprises. From all these words, our language rises. Oh. <gasps> Biddy biddy bum a bop. Hey now, book, it's time to drop. <gasps> Bugorific! How'd you do it? Magic. <laughs> no, really, Alex, tell me how you did it. Sorry, no can do. Why not? According to the Magician's Code of Honor, a magician never reveals his secret. Huh? You just made that up. Did not. Come on, tell me! Magician's code, can't. Hello, my friendly friends. Tell me, Alex, please. Oh, I seem to have interrupted something of a not nice nature. Okay, I did a magic trick that Zoe never saw before, right? Now she says I have to tell her how I did it. So tell her. I can't. It's against the magician's secret code of honor. So don't tell her. Iggy, I can't believe that you're taking his side. So tell her. I can't. So don't tell her. Iggy. <laughs> I am glad I could be of service. Whoa! What was that? Something's wrong. What is it, Livingston? I don't know. I've never seen the court act this way, ever. <laughs> if this book is right, I just hit the main root of the core. <laughs> <laughs> it's a core spore extravaganza! <laughs> One little two, little three, little core spore, four little five, little six, little core spore, seven little eight, little nine, little core spore, ten core spore for me. <laughs> Wheeze, that you? I've never seen so many core spore come down. Grab everyone you see and make sure no one spots you. Not a problem. <laughs> Once we crack open these babies, an Amelia will never be the same. Hello, hoo hoo, core spore. Come out, come out, wherever you are. It's too dark to see anything. We'll never find him tonight. What should we do, Zoe? 
Iggy, please tell Alex I'm not talking to him. Zoe says she's not talking to you. She's still upset about that magic trick. Alex wonders if you are still upset about his magicalness. Please tell Alex I'm not upset. I'm just very disappointed. Zoe says... I heard. I heard. What we have here is a failure to communicate. They're also not talking to each other, either. Same thing, Egg. I know, I know, but I love to pound away at the obvious whenever possible. That is one tough nut to crack. Zoe and I'll show this to Livingston. You guys keep searching. There are more of these out there somewhere. We're on it. Great, let's roll. Iggy, please tell Alex that I'll go, but I won't be talking on the way. What she said. Fine. I like peace and quiet. Tell me how you did that trick. Sorry, can't. Alex! Hmm. I've never seen this sort of course ball. We can't figure out how to open it. Before we do that, we should make sure we know what we're doing. Let's check the course owner's manual in the catacombs. <sighs> And feeding of the core, volume 2008. I found the index! Good. We need any information we can find about this particular course ball. This could take a while. Whoa. Interesting. What's this all about? Bingo. Hey, over here! Listen to this. The language core spore are a collection of subspores. They are all connected to the largest one called the origin spore. In Animalia, Communication began thanks to the core's origin spore. This special core spore allowed each species to develop its own original language. Ooh, I want to record this. The origin core spore connects all animalians, giving each animal the ability to use words to communicate. I think that's the one we found. It's protected by a heavy outer husk. Should the origin spore ever be damaged, Every animal in Animalia would be affected. In a bad way, no doubt. If what that book says is true, this is heavy duty. Can we call a truce? Sure. As soon as you tell me how you do that trick. I can't. Then no truce. I wonder how this happened. Rats? Big rats. With pickaxes. Pick, how's about a pit stop at the treehouse for a banana pick me up? Pick me up and off we go. <gasps> a bongo berry! <gasps> hey, let's make that a banana and bongo berry pick me up. Extra bongo berry for me. Yes, hilarious. Aren't you the Joker? Let's chuckle, shall we? <laughs> you should have seen your face. <laughs> priceless. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Now those are priceless. Nice stripes. If one of these is the origin spore, and according to this book, it sure looks like it, I'll be taking over Animalia in no time. 
I bet you meant to say, we'll be taking over Animalia, but forgot. Yeah, yeah, whatever. And about that course ball collection fee we discussed. Sure, right. But first, let's get these out of sight. In there? Really? Have you cleaned it up yet? Come on! Should the origin spore ever be damaged, every animal in Animalia would be affected. So what's the correct way to open it, and what's not? Maybe this will help. Found this in a cave painting down there. These arrows and symbols look like some kind of code. Once again, the student is way ahead of the teacher. Nice job, Sketch Boy. Thanks. So we're communicating again. No, but nice job anyway. Right. Oh, can't get it open. Oh. About my finder's fee. Later. <laughs> This part should slide open and then turn this, uh, give it a twist and... <clears throat> nope, you try. <sighs> why won't it open? I think I know why. Why? Because this isn't the origin course bore. It must still be out there. But where? <clears throat> <clears throat> The bananas are waiting for their bungleberry buddy. Yeah, I'll be there in a sec. This baby is tough to open. <coughs> Track down Gabubu and Diggy. Maybe they found the origin spore. <laughs> uh, is that a good thing? For me, it is. Zoe, if they did find it, make sure that Regatta Flossum Abarangal Chabata Rocker. Huh? Come again? Regatta Flossum Abarangal Chabata Rocker. Oh. Ha <laughs> Leona Laka Regatta Flossum Rocker. Livingston, I think you're speaking in the lion language, and we don't know how to snuff, snuckle, snort, snicker, snoot. Raga, roar, rumble, ramble, rangango. Snuffle, snack, sniggle, snort. Alex, no matter what, we should start communicating with each other again. Somebody better. Eh. Two buckets of hog slop, heavy on the slop. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Come on, rumble, broth, brottle, broth, brothel. Zaba Zuba Zaba I can't hear you, Tyrannicus. Everyone's talking in their own languages. It's wild here. I said, this latest plan is really going to pay off. Fuchsia, what are you babbling about? Fofa lufa nithko fa lufa lufa. Rabba rack rattle rough. Livingston, are you speaking lion? Ramble raff ramble. Snurfle sniff snoodle. Rini, are you speaking rhino? Snuff snaggle snurf. Roger raffle roger ramble. I sure wish we did. We better find that origin spore fast. This is the hardest bungleberry nut I ever tried to open. Here it goes. <laughs> Give me a countdown, egg. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Kiska, fish, shiska, mish. Egg. Shiska, this mishka, pish. Dude, why are you suddenly talking lizard? Tishka, hiska, bish, hisses. Yeah, I, I can't understand you. I didn't take lizard in school. I took gorilla and peacock. Ah! Hey. <laughs> he took peacock too. Excellent. Ha -ha! Ha -ha! Ha -ha! Oh, good point. We better go see Livingston and find out what kookiness is going on. We're off. Ha -ha! <sighs> it's not here. What do you mean it's not here? What's not here? The origin core spore. These are language spores. When you crack them open, each one reactivates a different animal language. How do you know that? I just read it. Right here. You can read that gibberish? How? It's written in weasel, my native tongue. Ah, 
That would explain it. According to this, the origin spore is bigger. Well, I only found these small ones. Did you search everywhere? Pretty much. Where didn't you search? <sighs> I'll be right back. Raw Lumber Ruffin. Raw Lumber Ruffin. That means the origin core spore, right? <laughs> Rollo. Rollo. If we find it, we'll be gentle with it. Rollo. Rollo means gentle in lion. Got it. Hmm. I didn't search here. Ah! Ah! Gaboo-boo? Iggy? Ah! That's Peacock for something funny's going on. Snurt Snuffle! Snurt Snuffle! And that's Rhino for we know, we know! This is a disconish! Iggy can only talk in Lizard and Peacock. Oh, ah! For the time being, Ig, stick with Lizard. This is Flesh! We need to find that origin course for it now. It lets Animalians speak all sorts of languages. But if it gets damaged, they won't be able to speak any language at all. Come on! Snuffle, sniffle, sniff! Rollo, Rollo, Rollo! <laughs> Banana breath baboon? Come to Papa! So that little core spore we found, why isn't the right one? Right! And if we don't find the origin spore, Animalians won't be able to communicate in any language? Right! So what's the origin spore look like? A lot like the small one, but bigger. Uh -uh! You're right, Ig! That looks just like the Mondo Bongo Berry we found. Must be the origin spore! Where is it? The treehouse. Where's my tracks? Wait, I know a shortcut. Gotta love the portals. Whoa! I thought it was a big bongo berry. We were trying to make a smoothie out of it. Glad you didn't do that. Hey, where's Iggy? He must have missed the turnoff. Uh oh, where'd it go? It's gone! Somebody took it! But who? This is just a guess, but these look a lot like tiger tracks. <laughs> yeah, this is it! The big one! The origin spore! Oh, yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Once this baby is destroyed, all communication in Animalia will be a thing of the past. And in the chaos, I can take control. Uh, we. We can take control. What's with this we business? I just want to be clear. We're partners on this, correct? Give it back. Not until we have an agreement. I agree. To disagree! Yeah! Let's us communicate. Origin course for levitate. <gasps> right there. This is the code of how to open it. Carefully. Help me with this. Sure. Huh? Oh. 
A chain? That makes sense. The origin core spore is what links us all together. Communication through language. Back into the core, where it belongs. Rah-rah, but aura lava. <laughs> Rhino is a beautiful language, Rini. Snurfle snootsnip. Thanks. I really want to learn lion. Can you teach me? Be glad to. Hey, dude! Where you been? Uh -huh. Huh? <laughs> it is a joking. Just kidding. I'm back in my full iguana and chameleon voice. Good job, Ig. You saved the day. Naturally. Iggy saved the day? How? I guess I can tell you now, but you have to promise to never give away the secret. Huh? The secret of that magic trick, with the book and the course ball? It's not really magic at all. It's me, in my chameleon mode. Impressive, if I say so myself. So that's how you did it. Friends again? Amigos, chums, pals. Hey, Livingston, how do you say friend in line? Rimpopo. In Rhino? Snuggle. In Peacock? Ah! In any language you like? Friends! Ah! <laughs> <laughs>